Hey, welcome to HD Geek Review. My name is Mark, and today we're going to take a look at the Rode PSA1 Studio Arm, which is this contraption I have right here. If you're a YouTube content creator or podcaster, and you're currently rocking a tabletop microphone stand, and now you're looking to improve your setup and clear some desktop space, stick around. All right, so let's go hands-on with this thing. So the Rode PSA-1 has a good range of motion. Uh, it actually can rotate a full 360 degrees. It's capable of uh, supporting a microphone from one and a half pounds to 2.4 pounds. My uh, Shure SM7B is actually 1.69 pounds. So, and it has no problem whatsoever uh, supporting that. In fact, I also have a headset uh, hanging from it. The lower hinge, the one closest to the table, has about 45 degrees of play in it, allowing you to push that vertical arm back and forward about 45 degrees. The middle hinge has about 90 degrees of play, so you can angle and articulate that arm up and down about 90 degrees. And finally, thumb screws at the neck allow you to tilt your microphone about 90 degrees. It may be possible to go more than 90 degrees, but the uh, XLR cable seems to come in contact with the frame or get in the way of the thumb screws. Installation is pretty easy. They give you a desk clamp or a desk insert. I am going with the desk insert, which means I'm gonna have to do some drilling. My weapon of choice will be this 7 eighths inch shank, which I'll use to cleanly drill a hole in my one inch thick desk. Now, they recommend that the desk is uh, about one inch thick and that your hole is cut two and a half inches from the side or from any side. Once you drill your hole, you're going to want to get the provided desk insert, which is going to provide a lot of reinforcement to that wood. You're going to slide that insert into the hole and then secure it from the bottom. Finally, you're going to insert the desk arm into the hole. Plug in your microphone cables. I'm actually using an XLR cable because my mic requires XLR inputs. Uh, this will work just fine with a USB mic, so keep that in mind. And just like that, you're ready to rock and roll. As stated previously, there's more than one way to skin a cat, and Rode was kind enough to include a desk clamp, so you don't have to drill holes into your desk. I just like to play these games on ultra difficulty. Now, actually, I have good reason for not using this, and you'll see why in a minute. Again, it is sturdy and it is good, but my desk didn't cooperate. I have a slanted edge on my desk, and this clamp, though good and to no fault of Rode, does not work for my desk. It needs to be a nice rectangular edge. Anyway, that's the Rode PSA1 Studio Arm. As always, I'll leave a link to this product in the description below. If you have questions or comments, leave them in the comments section below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you next time.